Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I have a very exciting collaboration with the one, the only, The Last Coffee Bean. Now, if you aren't subscribed to her, what are you doing? Please subscribe to her linked above. She has an amazing channel here on YouTube. She makes some amazing art videos. And yeah, so basically, we decided to surprise each other with $90 Canadian worth of items related to each of our channels. So my channel is mainly about Harry Potter. So she decided to surprise me with $90 worth Worth of Harry Potter items that can be Lego and can be Dobby sock for all I know hopefully it's not that or also be a little bit disappointed if I do say so myself <laughs> I trust her enough to know that she didn't get me that but you know anything from her means a lot to me so yeah so in return, I decided to surprise her with $90 worth of art supplies from Amazon because her channel is an art channel. So I decided to surprise her with art supplies because why not? <laughs> what else, right? <laughs> Without further ado, let's crack open these packages starting with the small one. Now, honestly, I had a ton of time to just procrastinate and think about what's inside of these packages. Now the small ones here, these little packages are from Bricklink. And Bricklink is actually like this online Lego kind of store where you can buy different minifigures, parts and pieces and sets. So I believe that we have minifigures inside of here because they feel like minifigures. And which ones? That's the question. Let's start off with this brown one here. <laughs> Moment of truth. I wonder what mischief she managed. Let's see. Okay, okay, <laughs> I'm kind of nervous. I think it's a minifigure. I feel it. And yes, now I'm not even gonna act surprised because she told me she got me this. This is like the only thing that I was 100% sure she got me. <laughs> it is a Death Eater. She knows I love Death Eaters and I do love Death Eaters and I think that they're really awesome. Personally, my favorite thing out of Harry Potter, other than the Queen Bellatrix Lestrange. Let me just uh, take the hat out of there. And ooh, it even comes with a little wand. Now, if I know what's inside, I'm not even going to try faking it. <laughs> I knew that she would get me this because she told me. Because, you know, I kept, you know, guessing until I got it right. And she couldn't tell me no, so yeah. So we have a really cool looking classic Death Eater minifigure from 2019. Now the design is quite classic with the really cool pointed hat. I actually own one of these already, but having more is always better, especially because they are quite generic. Look at that detail there. <laughs> the head looks phenomenal. The torso is awesome. And on the back there, just black. Really, really awesome figure. And I'm so excited to add it to my ever growing army. Next up, we have package number two. Now, this is also a minifigure, and I genuinely don't know what's inside of this. I was guessing maybe Cedric Diggory because, you know, I spent some time before going to sleep, and I was like, who is inside of this package? Who is inside? Who do I not have? And I know, I wasn't supposed to feel through it, but, you know, my guess right off the bat is Cedric Diggory. Now, if it's Cedric, I'm going to be kind of sad because, because I don't really like Cedric. Maybe this is like her form of revenge because I got her chalk. But yeah, first of all, we have a business card. Thank you so much for your order. And it says Nub Select Bricks. Cool. <laughs> okay, if this is Cedric, I'm going to be so proud of myself for guessing. <laughs> they don't call me a genius for nothing. Now, it is indeed Cedric Diggory. No wonder she acted all surprised and she got mad she was like why did you why, why are you thinking why did you think obviously not real mad <laughs> just jokingly mad but there you go i am right we have cedric diggory in his herbology outfit and you know i'm not even gonna act sad because avada kadabra <laughs> is gone he died <laughs> he died <laughs> okay yeah Next up, we have this package here that is actually from Etsy. Now, I know it's from Etsy because she told me it's from Etsy. It feels very soft and I actually have no idea what's inside of here. But let's just dive in. I'm kind of nervous because it feels like cloth. <laughs> can I wear it to campus? Maybe she can see me wearing this one day if it's an outfit. The last coffee bean, I hope you have a wonderful fashion sense because if you don't, then uh, I guess I'm stuck with this. I just, I see the Slytherin colors. What is it though? Oh my God, that is so cool. 
cool. For a second, I was confused. I was like, is that a hat? <laughs> what? No, now that is actually so cool. <laughs> it says Slytherin House fandom inspired fingerless gloves. Now this will be very, very useful, even for university to keep me warm. Let me try them on. I hope I'm putting them on the right way, but wow. Swift Freaks can't wear gloves confirmed. I think that these are fantastic. I think I'm gonna be doing the rest of the video with these on because they're just so comfy and cozy and I believe that they are actually handmade from Etsy. But I'm keeping these on guys. I can't take them off. Thank you so much to The Last Coffee Bean. I wish I was that thoughtful, honestly. <laughs> my initial reaction was confusion because in my head, I was expecting a Hermione Granger plush and I was ready to go off on her. <laughs> I was gonna be like, you got me Hermione Granger as a plushie, how dare you? But so far, everything is perfect. And I'm just, I'm just blown away by how well she knows me. <laughs> Next up, we have this noodle of a package. So it is quite long there. My guess is that it might be a wand because it's kind of like a noodle, but you know, I'm really bad at guessing clearly because I got the gloves wrong. <laughs> I can't believe I almost thought she would disappoint me and make me sad. She would never do that to me. No way. I hope I didn't speak too soon. But yeah, let's uh, crack this open because why not? This is exciting. So far, the last coffee bean has been doing a fantastic job with this. Okay, now moment of truth, guys. I hope my mic, oh, there's a letter. Now the letter from amazon.ca says, for stabbing rude hairdressers and people leaning on your shoulder unexpectedly, sad face. I wonder what it is. I, I mean, the note just flew right, How much did this cost? Wow. <laughs> I wonder what I'm gonna, one second. I'm just a little bit confused right now. So it looks like our good friend got us a set of daggers. What am I gonna do with these? These are so cool. I mean, I always talk about Bellatrix Lestrange's dagger because I think it's so cool. And I was like, what if I can open packages with this? Speaking of which, I'm probably gonna open my next package with these. I know I'm not, acting super surprised, but I just want to see how it looks and what it's made of. I'm just ripping right through this. Wow, now that, oh no, I just ripped the box. <laughs> so much for safekeeping. Now here it is. Oh my God, it even feels heavy. Like it feels really premium. I have to hang this on my wall. <laughs> this is just amazing. She knows me too well, I'm scared. <laughs> She knows me way too well. Now, if you open it, like, I think I'm acting like I know how to use this, but ooh, if you actually, it's actually real. This is fantastic. Honestly, I'm just gonna have it with me at all times. Everything is perfectly balanced as all things should be. And this is just beautiful. I had a moment there of shock. I was like, she actually did it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Last but not least, I have the final Amazon package. So far, the last coffee bean has been so nice to me. She's making me feel very bad for what I did to her in her video. And here's a live demo of me using this dagger for the first time. Uh, yeah. <laughs> am I a natural? I am a natural, thank you very much. For all the people who, ow, for all the people who doubted me. I'm a handshake. This is actually work. This is actually working. Okay. I can't get rid of these gloves. They're so good. Okay, so it seems like on the inside we have some amazing bubble wrap. And of course some notes here. Let me just read them. It says for <laughs> I can't read this. It says for drinking the blood of your stab victims. <laughs> I'm not making any of that up, I promise. So <laughs> so what I think it is, honestly, the last coffee bean, you are the best. I don't even know what else to say. Let's do this. I'm getting so used to my dagger. It's not even funny. Okay, there we go. Okay, my guess, so they're in, right? Let's see. 
This is just extremely well thought out. We have a look at this <laughs> Slytherin mug here. Look at the design on this mug. The Slytherin logo is so, so amazing. You can even see the secondary one there. And the overall vibe and aesthetic of this is so me. I know that sounds cliche. Well guys, that pretty much wraps up this very fun unboxing and collaboration with The Last Coffee Bean. Please check her out linked above and in the description box down below. Now, honestly, I can't take these gloves off. They're so warm and cozy. They'll keep me warm all the time and I don't see myself taking them off anytime soon. And she honestly just blew me away with her choices. And again, very grateful for everything that she got me in this video. Please check her out linked above and check out her video of the items that I got her for the same price of $90 Canadian. Don't forget to subscribe to The Last Coffee Bean. And on that, I'll see you guys later. Bye for now.